Hello, my friends. Welcome to Sophia's language class. And you are watching the dumbhead YouTuber who doesn't even know how did she set her camera wrong and keep filming it. I can't understand why the fuck did I stand on side shot. I was gonna throw away this bold video in the trash bin, but I I watched a Korean YouTuber who edited his spoiled video like this. So I brought that back again, and it was so admiring. I know I don't need to explain everything about why I spoiled this video, but I wanna say just one fact that I was so busy this week because of a, a Korean holiday, Chuseok. So I didn't have any minutes to record, so I did it in other places secretly. And this is the result. Today's word is kurida. 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 Sounds like Italian. But it's Korean. Kurida. The original meaning is shitty smell. It smells like shit. It smells like dung. Like your fart smell is kurida. <coughs> the original verb is kurida is usually used as conjugated present tense. A o yo. A o yo is the suffix for verb stem and it makes connection with other verb after it. But in this video, we'll learn a o yo. So when verb stem's vowel is a o, then a come to end, and o u and u e, then o come to the end. And in hada verb, yo come to the end. So kurida is kuri o. But but for easier pronunciation, kuryo, kuryo. So just kuryo is commonly used as casual, impolite form. But when it's used in a stuff or people, it means as low quality, like this video. If your friend make a nickname like McLovin, then you can say McLovin? No kuryo. When the pizza face flirt you. No <laughs> kuryo. In the gloomy weather. Oh, 날씨가 왜 이렇게 구려? When you order a gorgonzola pizza, but it tastes awful. Oh, gorgonzola zola 구려. And this is trendy word, which is same meaning. 짜치다. 짜치다. I don't know where it come from, but I sometimes heard it from my young students. It's totally same with 구려, so you can use it 짜쳐 instead of 구려. McLovin? 존나 짜쳐. 존나 짜쳐. 어, 날씨 왜 이렇게 짜쳐? See you next video.